The Dolphins are gearing up for their game against the Chiefs in Germany, but today they enjoyed a day of sightseeing around Frankfurt. Yeah, why not? CBS News Miami's Kim Camper caught up with players and a few fans ahead of the international matchup. Well, after an eight-hour transatlantic flight, the Dolphins are in Frankfurt, Germany, for a game against the Kansas City Chiefs, and it's beer gardens brought worse in all you can see in Germany. The fans are all over the place. They're excited about NFL football, but the Dolphin players had the day off, and they got to taste a little of the local flavor right here in Frankfurt. Hans und Franz. Hans und Franz. Hans und Franz. The Dolphins had the day off today. They had a chance to go downtown, visit some of the sites, enjoying themselves, getting among the people. And they certainly enjoyed what they saw. I'm trying to find some real German cuisine, looking for a bratwurst, maybe a currywurst, you know, something to really, you know, get rooted in the, in the, in the culture. That's plenty, that's plenty. Excuse me, what you get? Uh, I don't know, it's called the, the donor sandwich, the donor sandwich, yeah. Appreciate you, thank you very much. So far, so good. Um, just walking around, you know, I'm 30% German, I did my 23 Me, so just trying to get familiar with my roots, you know, so that's all. I'm loving it, watching Christians eating a glizzy right now. Uh, <laughs> don't be shy. <laughs> all right, so the game's still a ways away. People are just coming into town. A lot of people want to see the game. And today as we were walking away, ran into some fans that are really excited to be here. Guess who they're rooting for? And, and are you excited about seeing, seeing a game out of the country and find out what these fans are going to react to it. Absolutely. We've been season ticket holders for 56 years. Yeah. So um, uh, we've always watched them in Kansas City. So now we're going to see them here in Frankfurt. So you guys come out just to kind of wander around and you run into a pack of Dolphin players. How, how was that experience? It's exciting. Yeah, I've been playing football in Germany for the last five years and I always dream of a day like this. So I'm happy. Oh, sorry. I can't curse. I'm happy as hell right now. Are you excited about the NFL coming to uh, Frankfurt? Yes, I'm a big fan of the New England Patriots, and I love it so much. I am looking... Whoa, 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 whoa. It's the Dolphins here, not the Patriots. Both. Both. Oh, you like both? Yes. No, you don't. You really like the Patriots, right? No, no, no. Oh, so who's your both. favorite player? And Tom Brady. Tom, well, he's not in the Patriots anymore, though. Yeah, but okay. it's okay. So are, are you guys Dolphins fans? I'm a Cowboys fan, to be honest, but hey, I well, love... Oh, you got the New York. Well, what about the Cowboys? <laughs> you split in surface. You split in... No, no. What about you? I'm a Patriots fan. Oh, geez. Yeah. It's nice I'm talking sorry. to you guys. I'm sorry. Well, so as you can see, the players are certainly excited to, to experience Frankfurt and Germany and all it has to offer. And the fans, well, they can't wait for the game, but there's still a long way to go. But the one thing we know, I think the fans here are going to be a little more... Pl maybe not kind of like some of the fans back in the United States, where when you kind of look around, they're like schmucks. I don't think we have any here. From Frankfurt, Germany, I'm Kim Camper, CBS Miami. Where all those Patriot fans come from? I don't from? know. The Dolphins will show up later in the week. We're usually fashionably late. <laughs> <laughs> A reminder that CBS News Miami is your Dolphin station. Kim Camper will be with the fans all week in Germany. Watch his reports right here on CBS Miami all week long. And then on Sunday, we'll get things started early with Dolphins Weekly Live at 11 in the morning, then with the coach Mike McDaniel show at 8.30, and then join us for the fifth quarter on TV 33 after the game.